Hey, what's up everybody? Now I'm sure we've all heard from one of the many reviewers here on YouTube the term slow burn. Now normally I just gloss over this term, kind of like a word that you can't pronounce in a book because it doesn't matter because you don't need to until you're talking to somebody else who has read the book and they think it's pronounced different than you do. But anyway, I think I finally figured out what this term really means. So let's break it down word by word. You got the word slow, which means not fast. Then you got the word burn, which means on fire. But what do these terms mean for movies specifically? Well, the word slow obviously means boring. Because think about all the things that are slow in real life. Snails, boring. Old people, boring. Minivans, boring. Then you got the word burn, which means on fire. And things on fire, they're exciting. Think about it. Money, exciting. Cars, exciting. The Batman logo, very exciting. So on the one hand, you got boring. But on the other hand, you got exciting. How do these things fit together? They don't. So whenever you have a movie that's boring, but you like it and you want it to sound exciting, you can be like, hey, this movie was a real slow burn. That way, when they come back later and they're like, yo, man, I saw that Foxcatcher movie. It was super boring. Ah, it was a slow burn. Remember, I told you that when I described it to you earlier. Okay, so maybe calling a movie a slow burn is a slight bit deceiving. But who cares? Everybody's doing it. You'll sound like a real YouTube reviewer and not like some guy in his bedroom with less than 50 subscribers. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. I hope this video was educational. If you learned something, hit that subscribe button down below, and I will see you next time.